Okay, in this tutorial, I just briefly want to review the tools we need to follow along with the course. Basically, you need Apache Maven version 3.2 or above. We use Maven from the command line and also from an integrated development environment. And the example of an IDE is Eclipse, and I'll be using Eclipse version 4.3 or Kepler. In fact, I'll be using the Java EE edition because along with the console application we'll be using, we'll also be developing a very simple and lightweight web application. And the Java E edition of Eclipse makes our lives that little bit more easy because it provides all the various plugins necessary. Now once we've built a web application, we need to deploy it onto a web application server. Now I'm using Apache Tomcat version 7. Again, you don't need to use these tools, you can use your own environment. But if you have any problems or issues, it makes it a lot easier for me to try and help you if you're using the same versions and tools I am. In the coming tutorials, I'll show you where to find Apache Maven, how to download it, how to install it on your machine. I'll also show you how to check your current development environment to see if you're working on a Java EE edition of Eclipse. And if you aren't, it's not a problem. We can just go to the internet and download that version. And I'll show you how to do that also. Now, as far as the Tomcat server is concerned, I also provide a tutorial to show you where to find that, how to install it on your local machine, and also how to configure that with your Java EE version of Eclipse. So in the next tutorial, we'll be downloading and installing Apache Maven 3.2.